ASMR video. As you can see today, we are going to learn German. You will learn it. I know it. Tiny bit. But I'm going to teach you some essential words that you are going to need if you want to visit Germany or Austria or Switzerland or any other place that, where they speak German so those are words that will be extremely important and what I want from you I think I have 40 words prepared uh, is to repeat the words after me I will always explain to you what that word means and how to use it when to use it and, and stuff like that so if you don't want to learn or you know these words you can just close your eyes lay down put your earphones into your ears and listen listen to stuff so let's start with number one so the number one is Donau Damp Schiff Fahrts Gesellschafts Kapitän Donau Damp Schiffs Fahr Gesellschafts Kapitän It's basically what it means It's Danube Steamship Company Captain uh, which refers to a captain working for a Danube Steamship Company so this is really important word to know if you happen to be in Germany near Danube like 50 years back uh, so if you time travel back in time and you happen to be near Danube in Germany this word you will probably use almost every day uh, so it's important so please repeat after me Donau Dampf Schiffs Fahrts Gesellschafts Kapitän Donau Dampf Schiffs Fahrts Gesellschafts Kapitän Good Okay, we can move to next word and the next word is Rindfleisch Etikettierungsüberwachungsaufgaben Übertragungsgesetz. So I will repeat. It's really easy word. So you should be able to repeat after me. Rindfleisch Etikettierungsüberwachungsaufgaben What does this mean? It's a law concerning the delegation of duties for the supervision of cattle marking and the labeling of beef. This is another really important word, especially if uh, you want, if you work in beef industry in Germany, which can be like common if you want to go to work to Germany, you maybe need to get a job in beef packing and labeling factory so this is the word that we will use basically daily so let's repeat again after me Rindfleisch Etikettierungsüberwachungsaufgaben Übertragungsgesetz and once again Rindfleisch Etikettierungsüberwachungsaufgaben Übertragungsgesetz Good job. Let's move to the word number three. This one is actually even more useful than the previous ones. Kraftfahrzeug, Haftpflichtversicherung. Kraftfahrzeug, Haftlich Versicherung. What does this word mean? This means motor vehicle liability insurance, which is a very important thing to get. Let's be honest, we all need motor 
vehicle liability insurance. I don't want to say especially if you are a woman, but you know, it kind of implies that. Uh, but uh, you know, little fender benders and stuff like that happen all the time. So it's better to get the insurance. So let's repeat after me again. Kraftfahrzeug Haftpflichtversicherung. Kraftfahrzeug Haftpflichtversicherung. Good job. So that's definitely one of the first things that you want to get in Germany. Next one. Unabhängigkeitserklärungen. Unabhängigkeitserklärungen. What does it mean? This is Declaration of Independence. Very popular word uh, in American peers of ours. That's what they like worship. Their Declaration of Independence, which is former assertion of autonomy by a state or religion. So let's again. If, if if you can, you don't have to use it only in Germany, you can use it in USA, where you will get many popularity points. So, let's repeat up on me. Unabhängigkeitserklärungen. Unabhängigkeitserklärungen. And now I want to declare the independence from this word. Let's go to another one. This one, again, important one. Rechtsschutzversicherungsgesellschaften. Rechtsschutzversicherungsgesellschaften. Which means legal protection insurance companies. Uh, basically companies that provide insurance covering legal advice and litigation costs. Again, another very important thing to get in Germany. Uh, to, you know, always laws are like, you know, they always want to hurt you. People always want to hurt you. So it's good to have some legal protection insurance from some company. So for that you will need this word. So repeat after me. Rechtsschutzversicherungsgesellschaften. Rechtsschutzversicherungsgesellschaften. Nice. Let's move to another one. This one is Massenkommunikationsdienstleistungsunternehmen. Dienstleistungsunternehmen. Massenkommunikationsdienstleistungsunternehmen. Massenkommunikationsdienstleistungsunternehmen. And it means mass communication service company. Mass communication service company. So basically, company that provides mass communication services. So that's a really important word too, actually, because, you know, we want to be without internet or to call someone, you don't have to call, like, I'm still showing call like that, but new people are showing it, not new people, like, uh, young people are showing it like, I don't know, uh, this or this, this, yeah, this maybe, this, but we call, we show it like this, we, we old people, we seniors show it like this so again repeat after me massenkommunikations dienstleistungsunternehmen massenkommunikations dienstleistungsunternehmen let's move to another one this one is really important too especially if you if you i will show you Nahrungsmittel und Fertigkeit. Nahrungsmittel und Fertigkeit. 
which means food intolerance like reaction to some sort of food if you have to nuts some people don't like nuts some people don't like milk some people don't like wheat some people don't like anything and they only drink water and I don't know what so that's important to know your food intolerances because if you eat nuts you can die if you drink milk you can die of embarrassment if you are not close to the toilet and stuff like that so repeat after me Nahrungsmittelunwertlichkeit Nahrungsmittelunwertlichkeit Good job Next one Sozialversicherungs Angestellte Sozialversicherungsfach Angestellte Yes, I think it's right Which means Social Insurance Specialist Which is again another important thing You want social insurance So you have to find a specialist that will do that How you find him in Germany you need this word. So repeat after me. Sozialversicherungsfach Angestellte. Sozialversicherung Fachs Angestellte. Ja. Nice. Let's move to another word. This one is really heartwarming and really uh, that you should do often. Freundschaftsbezeugung Freundschaftsbezeugung Which means demonstration of friendship And you should definitely demonstrate friendship To your boyfriends, to your girlfriends You know uh, You want to do it Not like very, very uh, Aggressively But you want to do it kindly And and stuff like that, you know Especially if it's in opposite gender You don't really want to feel like desperate call to date someone And it's really delicate balance So let's repeat after me Freundschaftsbezeugung Freundschaftsbezeugung Yeah, nice Let's move to another word Mehrheitsbeteiligungserwerb Erwerb Mehrheitsbeteiligungserwerb Erwerb Mehrheitsbeteiligungserwerb Maybe that's one, no, 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 it's Erwerb Yeah, I think It means acquisition of majority stake the purchase of majority of shares in the company so for all you you definitely want to move to Germany to overtake uh, companies like Amazon and, and stuff like that so uh, this will be very useful for most of you uh, you will be definitely overtaking uh, companies because you are successful young promising individuals that's why you are on this video and that's exactly why you are subscribing and liking the video right now and you are writing down the comment I am really high value individual that's the comment that you are writing down in the comments and if you are level above you are writing this word Mehrheitsbeteiligungs Erwerb Mehrheitsbeteiligungs Erwerb So, if that word is down in the comments You will have a good luck Overtaking German companies Let's move to another word Kindergartenpreisermäßigung Kindergartenpreisermäßigung Which means children's ticket price reduction That's another important thing that you really want If you have children, you want their 
ticket prices get reduced so you don't have to pay for them more you know because children are expensive as they are so there is no really really no need to pay more so this is the word that you will use repeat after me kindergarten price ermäßigung kindergarten price ermäßigung yeah next one Lebensversicherungspolis Lebensversicherungspolis I hope it's right Which means life insurance policy That's another thing that you want All the policies that we have Like right now We are discussing that's what you want You know, if you have loved ones And you accidentally get crushed by skull of dinosaur in your uh, part-time job in German Museum of Dinosaurs you want to have insurance uh, life insurance because it's very high risk that you know there is not a huge probability that if you get crushed by head of T-Rex that you will survive and you want some money to keep for your family before they uh, can get back on their feet so that's a very important thing to do so let's repeat after me Lebensversicherungspolis Lebensversicherungspolis good next one Personenkraftwagen Personenkraftwagen Which means passenger car A motor vehicle designed to transport people Basically car So personer Personenkraftwagen Again Getting a car is important Getting a driver's license is important You, you really don't want to be person without driver's license in the world With everyone who has driver's license Capish? Yeah So repeat after me Personenkraftwagen Personenkraftwagen Nice Let's move to another word Dampfschifffahrtsgesellschaft Dampfschifffahrtsgesellschaft Which is again an uh, important word It's the steamship company It's just a repetition, you know, to keep you uh, Keep you on your mind with the time traveling uh, Trip of yours So repeat after me Dampfschiff Fats Gesellschaft Dampfschiff Fats Gesellschaft Yeah Next one Geschwindigkeitsbegrenzung Geschwindigkeitsbegrenzung Begrenzung Yeah Geschwindigkeitsbegrenzung Which means speed limit You don't want to go over speed limit you really don't uh, I always say to everyone who drives uh, why? Well, why you will save like getting over the speed limit I, it's better to go a little bit under the speed limit you don't risk a ticket and you are safer you know because getting over the speed limit you the vehicle is really like the personal craft wagon is not really good uh, at riding and it can like sleep and you know you can have fender benders and you need to get the insurance policy it's all ties together so let's repeat after me Geschwindigkeitsbegrenzung Geschwindigkeitsbegrenzung next one Fernsehübertragungswagen Übertragungswagen, which means television broadcasting van. So if you want to, if you want to be like television host or television uh, cameraman or something like that, you will need the Fernsehübertragungswagen. 
Tagungswagen offer you will not need it for some illegal activities that uh, people in those vans commit sometimes too so that's not a video this one but I have some videos about doing illegal stuff uh, too if you find if you dig far enough so let's repeat after me Fanze ib trang Tragungswagen. Fernse Übertragungswagen. Next one. Verkehrsinfrastruktur Finanzierungsgesellschaft. Verkehrsinfrastruktur Finanzierungsgesellschaft, which means traffic insurance financing company. So basically company to fix roads, to fix and stuff like that uh, which is again really important because if you see a pothole you should definitely like film it send it to your local mayor of the town like every day be there uh, show them like uh, find there where they live and make photos of that pothole and like f uh, uh, may, uh, post it on every pole where they live so every day they have to go to uh, go to work they see just a bottle everywhere that one bottle uh, so they have dreams about it and they want to fix it so again verkehrs infrastruktur finanzierungsgesellschaft verkehrs infrastruktur finanzierungsgesellschaft good job next one konten überziehungskredit Content überziehungskredit, which means account overdraft credit. Another important f thing because you will definitely be broke at the start your trip to Germany before you start overtaking the companies. Uh, so you will need some credit, you know. So uh, in Czechia we call it conto current. Uh, basically, how 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 deep into the hells of financial financial underworld you can go you know you pay with money that you don't have and the bank somewhere hopes you will give it back for some big fee so repeat after me konten überziehungskredit konten überziehungskredit nice let's move to another one weitere Bildungs Einrichtungen weitere Bildungs Einrichtungen which means further education facilities institutions providing education beyond the basic level which you do you want you know uh, to get some basic skills in German in in like managing and stuff like that so let's repeat after me weiter bildungs and reichtungen weiter bildungs and reichtungen next one staats angehörigkeits angelegenheiten staats angehörigkeits angelegenheiten which means nationality matters Issues concerning a person's citizenship status. Yes, again, another important thing you want to get a German citizenship or Austrian or Swiss, which is probably the best Swiss one. Uh, how you can do it? By fraud, probably overtaking the companies, getting um, enough money to pay some politician that will uh, make it for you. So through lobbying, or you can probably marry someone to a citizenship test, but you know, that's that's so last century. So uh, again, Staatsangehörigkeits Angel an Angelegenheiten. Staatsangehörigkeits Angelegenheiten. Nice. Next one. Unfallversicherungsanstalt. 
Anstalt. Und Vorversicherungsanstalt, which means Accident Insurance Institution. That, again, important if you work in museum and you accidentally spill something on the floor, you fall. Uh, or even better, if, if you eat banana, you know, that happens all the time, you eat banana and you peel it off, you eat the banana and, and you forgot the peel on the floor it happens all the time you then go like do something for your work and you forget the, the beat is there you step on it and you fall you know but accidentally you hit yourself into the femur of huge pile of bones made into dinosaurs rex happens all the time so uh it all starts falling it's broken you know and the 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 damage is enormous, the financial, the psychological, everything. And you don't want to be like responsible financially. It's 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 dumb, you know. So you want to have accidents insurance in accident insurance institution. So they will pay for you. So again, let's repeat the word. Unfall unfall Versicherungsanstalt. Und Fall, und Fall, Versicherungsanstalt, und Fall, und Fall, und Fall, Versicherungsanstalt, ja. Next one. Zwischen staatliche Klimaabkommen. Zwischen staatliche Klimaabkommen, which means interstate climate agreement. That basically means that the climate between two, two states will be the same. A formal agreement on climate policy between states. You know, so like uh, that from one state they will not uh, like pump uh, farts into another state and, and you know, it happens all the time. Uh, so you, this was like more of the past problem so now uh, there are basically those policies between each state so everyone keeps their farts and climate stuff in the state and it doesn't go beyond the you know beyond the beyond the glass dome over every state which you probably didn't know if you weren't in germany that every state uh, has like glass barrier that you have to go through to another state to keep the keep them separate the climate keep separate so it can be like winter in one state and and really hot in another state and stuff like that so that's what the interstate climate agreement is for so again zwischen städtliche klima abkommen zwischen städtlichen klima abkommen next one Wirtschafts in Kai Ingenieur Wiss Wissenschaften. Ja, yeah, I'm really good at this. Wirtschafts Ingenieur Wissenschaften. Wirtschaft Ingenieur Wissenschaften. Business Engineering Sciences. A field combining business studies and engineering sciences. Again, important for overthinking the company. So let's move on. So repeat after me. Wirtschaftsingenieurwissenschaften. Wirtschaftsingenieurwissenschaften. Nice. Next one. Kunst of Fensterhersteller. I'm gonna shoot the dog. Kunst of Fenster Herstell. No, I wouldn't do that to the dog. Again, Kunst of Fenster Hersteller, which means plastic window manufacturer. You want plastic windows, they are better insulating. And Americans would not understand this, but we have windows that you can open like full, you can close them, and you can do ventilation and micro ventilation. They don't have that. They like. They always are like, what the hell, what are 
Windows, Windows, how does it work? Oh my god, it's so, it's so innovative and we have it like for, I don't know, 50 years. So again, read that one. Kunst of Fenster Hersteller. Kunst of Fenster Hersteller. Next one. Schadenfreude auslösend. Schadenfreude auslösend. Causing Schadenfreude. Describing something that triggers joy in someone else's misfortune. Yeah, that's common in German, in Germany and in Slavic countries too. So, no grudge there. So, again, Schadenfreude auslösend. Schadenfreude. Freude auslösend. Next one. Drei Käse hoch. Drei Käse hoch. Three cheeses high. A humorous description of a small child. Drei Käse hoch. That's always what uh, women told tell to me that I look like and now I know what that means and I want to cry. Uh, so again repeat after me. Drei Käse hoch. Drei Käse hoch. Nice. Next one. Fingerspitzen gefiel. Fingerspitzen gefiel which means fingertip feeling an intuitive flair or instinct intuitive flair or instinct mm, that's you know Ger germans german german has interesting words like that it can be this explained otherwise so finger spitz gefühl yeah finger spitz gefühl like feel 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 Next one, Welt Schmerz, Welt Schmerz, which means world pain, world pain. Okay, you probably have world pain from watching this video. A feeling of melancholy and world weariness. Yeah, so repeat after me, Welt Schmerz, Welt Schmerz. Next, Zeitgeist, Zeitgeist, Spirit of the Age, the defining spirit of mood of particular period of history. ASMR Zeitgeist, shout out to ASMR Zeitgeist. So, Zeitgeist, Zeitgeist, good job. Next one, Sprachgefühl, language feeling an intuitive understanding of language that's probably uh, mainly if you if it's your native language you know there is something really different with native languages uh, than learned languages like right now i'm speaking english but it's not my native language and you can see i sometimes uh, make mistake in like tenses and stuff uh, i sometimes say a word that doesn't exist that my my brain just made up and in czech it's completely on a different level, you know. It's the words that you never heard of, that are not, you know, active, active words. Uh, you still kind of know what they mean, uh, which is weird. But you probably heard them, heard them passively in school or in films and stuff like that. It's really interesting. So that's Sprachgefühl. Sprachgefühl. Next one. Vergange, Vergangenheit bewältigung. Vergangenheitsbewältigung. Coping with the past. Yeah. The struggle of come to terms with historical events, particularly the Nazi regime. Yeah. Or with my exes. That can be too. Coping with the past. I'm coping. I'm trying to cope. Vergangenheitsbewertigung. Vergangenheitsbewertigung. Nice. Next one. Another one. Zusammenschluss. Freude. 
Freudigkeit, Zusammenschluss Freudigkeit, Zusammenschluss Freudigkeit, and means prosperity of marriage, a tendency of entities to merge or join forces. That's what you are going to do after you start overtaking the companies and you merge them into one super company, German company. So, let's repeat the word Zusammenschluss Freudigkeit Zusammenschluss Freudigkeit Next one Habseligkeiten Habseligkeiten Belongings of news to describe all the possessions of a modest or impoverished person So that's that figure will use only on other people Habseligkeiten Habseligkeiten. Next one. Kummerspeck. Kummerspeck. Grief bacon. Excess weight gain from emotion overeating. That's my case. Kummerspeck. So I have Kummerspeck. Speck in Czech means Speck fat. Basically, fat that is from a pig. So it probably means that in German too. Kummerspeck is probably in German because che Czech and German has some words similar or we use like slang in slang we use German words uh, in in Czech form let's say. So grief bacon, Kummerspeck, Kummerspeck. Next one. Torschlusspanik. Torschlusspanik. Closing gate panic. The fear of diminishing opportunities as one gets older. Damn, this is like... Th this is like... This list is trying to mentally torture me. Torschluss Panik. So repeat after me. Torschluss Panik. That's something I definitely don't have. Torschluss Panik. Next one. Fernweh. Fernweh. Far sickness. An ache for distant places and a craving for travel. That's something I don't really have. I'm, I, I, I want to be at home all the time. Far sickness. Fernweh. Fernweh. Next one. Sitzfleisch. Sitzfleisch. I thought it's very good. Word we used in school all the time in Czech, in Czechia, sit flesh. We we say it a lot. Which means sitting flesh, the ability to endure a persist an activity. Basically, if you want to learn something, you need it's it's used like if you want something, you need good. You only if you want to study like some law or something, you only need good sit flesh, which means. Sitting on on your bum and reading. So, sit flash, sit flash. Next one. Back pfeifen Gesicht. Back pfeifen Gesicht. Back pfeifen Gesicht. A face that needs a fist. A colloquial term for someone with a highly slappable face. Yeah, some people are like that, that you are look them or you talk with them and they are like, in Czech we say, na uh, So, back pfeifen gesicht. Back pfeifen gesicht. Tell me someone, write me down in the comments, if you know a person that's back pfeifen gesicht. Next one. Treppenwitz. 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 Which means staircase joke. The predicament of thinking of the perfect lap reply too late that I have all the time. That's 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 the terrible feeling, you know. I'm I'm really good with it. Uh, if I can, as you can see, I'm just right now talking 40 minutes to myself and making jokes that probably no one loves about only me myself. But uh Treppenwitz is, especially if you are in school and someone likes or someone to tell you tells you something and it makes you mad and, and 
then you like go home and or you are on bus and now you think damn if I said this one I would like this would be like knockdown but it's too late so now you, you will not use it so trappen wits and the last one in error show einen hund in error Schweinen hund, which means inner big dog, the lazy part of oneself that resists effort, effort or change. Wow, so that's really inspiring. So the lazy part of oneself that resists effort of change. So repeat after me: innerer Schweinen hund, innerer Schweinen hund. And on this note, uh, I want you to, you know. Don't be lazy, don't have the lazy part of yourself and get better at everything so you can fulfill your dreams of going to Germany, overcating all those uh, companies, making all those insurances, using all these words. And uh, if you struggle with anything, uh, try to like focus on it, have good Sitzfleisch uh, in this Zeitgeist and try to overtake it. So that is all from me today. I hope you liked the basically pure whisper video uh, that you maybe learned something, that you maybe laughed, uh, definitely that you fell asleep. And well, I will see you in the next one.